again, is that first in, is that officer, I'm going to have to be doing some recon, right? I want to get in. Do we have a clean or dirty hallway in there? It's clean. I'm going to be putting that right through there, okay? Especially if it's self venting out that side. Is it open? Did we got open? Is it now dirty to where I have to sit there and lay out in the apartment? Or can I go to the hallway and lay out? So there's two ways. One, you either set it down on the ground and you can build it. The second way is you can build it from your shoulders. So I like to do a setting down. We were talking about earlier, man, I like to have full control of, of my line. So to me, the easiest place to do it and keep it nice and tight is going to be from the ground. So that's typically where I'll end up doing it. So I end up sandwiching everything down off my shoulder. I don't worry about the tails at all. I, I even stop like pulling it to straighten it because I just don't care. This is my objective. This is what I'm always concerned. I want it to look like this almost each and every time, right? So from here, you just turn around and get this out of the way. And then we're just gonna loop the same direction every time. We always start from the bottom, nozzle side, because we, when we lay it down, we need to supply on the bottom and we attack on top. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. So when we're forming our loops, right? Turn around and we're gonna go like that, right? And we're gonna stand up and open up. Or if we got room and we wanna make big loops, we can go every other bike. Yeah. Right? So there's that There's that as well. That'll reduce kinky potential of the line. So once we got all this, right, we're gonna stand up. Be cognizant of which way we want our line to kind of deploy out of. So for me, like I think it works well for like open areas and apartments. Like you're going in like this, like a living room. I can make a coil right from this living room. It's got a little dedicated location, right? It's, so I'm just gonna kind of line myself up at the door, feed the second hand through, step, pop, and then I always step through, through, and then so I always control nozzle by stepping, find my nozzle again, then I step on it, call for the charge, and this deploys out really nicely. This I'll get away from the door so that we got if any, the truck company is coming in and searching ahead, or another line is going to go off for a secondary line, then we got more room in this area. So just be cognizant of where we're setting these, these things up. If we need to push couches out of the way, dining tables out of the way, make it happen. Give yourself like a good five by five foot area to kind of make sure you got room to go.